Okay, hello guys so this is the samsung galaxy a72 and in this video i will show you how to root this one okay we're using the latest from our update the binary 5 on android 13 one ui version 5.1 okay so all the file and instruction i'll put it put in my blog you can check the link in the description box okay so from here you can install model help pause and other stuff okay if you need uh something to ask feel free to ask on the comment section okay so stay tuned and check it out hello oh, assalamualaikum we meet again with ombob so today i have uh, samsung pond this is the galaxy a72 and in this video i will show you how to root this pond you can see right here it's using the latest android version it's using the <clears throat> android routine on one ui version 5.1 and it's using the binary 5 okay it is the latest version when i'm making this video <clears throat> so as usual first thing you need to do is enable the developer option by hit the build number five times then go back go back again <clears throat> go to the developer options and make sure to turn on the OM unlock okay like this and you're ready to go okay now let's switch to the screen and for the next step you need to sock rom okay so this is my sock rom it's using the same version a72 fxxu5 okay this is binary 5 download it from the web okay i'm using the same uh same mobile <clears throat> you can search in here the latest version for example if i'm using the indonesian version just search, search for indonesia and download it okay you need to register to the website after you download you get <clears throat> a zip file like this just open it and extract to a folder i have extract to this folder uh, okay so you will get the apbl and other stuff <clears throat> okay and then the next step open the ap extract the boot emg.lg4 and the pb meta emg lg4 okay so <clears throat> extract again the boot image and also the pb meta okay so we get to file okay and then let's copy the path right here paste it again and select the two file we need to compress the two file Okay, so right click 7 zip add to archive and select the tar format. <clears throat> then we'll get uh, one tar file that contains the boot image and VBN meta. Okay, so let's copy this file. So connect your on to the computer and make sure you have activate the MTP. Okay, let's put it into the document folder right here. And we also need Magis. Okay, so let's copy the Magis APK. This time we're going to use the Magis Alba. <clears throat> okay, two files, and we're good to go. Now let's switch again the screen. And uh, now let's find the file manager, my file. Okay, go to the internal storage and find where you have copied the uh, two file. Okay, put it into the document folder. Install the Magis APK. Give it permission if needed. Okay, install and after it finishes, we can patch the <coughs> tar image. Okay, do, uh, okay, let's open it. <coughs> I'll go to the menu uh, sorry now let's go to the install menu right here select select and patch a file when where you have your file okay go to the 
Galaxy A72 document folder I put it in there and select the tar file okay hit let's go it will start uncompress patching the file and compress again okay after it finish it will put the new patch file into the download folder okay let's put down this and switch the screen again okay now let's go to the download folder find the magis underscore patch copy to a folder in your computer and we're done okay now the next step we need to unlock both other the pawn okay so let's switch again the screen and the next step we need to turn off the pawn okay this pawn can be turned off pressing the uh, volume down and the power button at the same time and then select power off okay and when the pawn has turned off we need to press the the two button the volume up volume down at the same time and then plug the usb cable okay let's try it okay you can see right here there is a warning uh, it said if you need to unlock the bootloader long press the volume up okay let's press the volume up about five seconds and after five seconds there is there will be another confirmation okay unlock bootloader it will ask or the unlock bootloader now press the volume up once okay it will automatically restart the pawn and unlock the bootloader okay let's wait until it goes to the <coughs> stock recovery it will format the data okay erasing and now let's press again the volume up volume down because we don't want to go to the android home screen now press the volume up one more time okay now we're good to go in the download mode Let's switch again. So in here I already have Odin. Okay, I will put all the files and step that needed. So go to the option tab, uncheck the auto reboot. Okay, copy the pad where you have the magic pad. Hit the AP button, paste the pad. And now let's hit the start button. It will start flashing and when it finishes it will become green and let's switch again we need to force reboot the pawn force reboot can be done by pressing the volume down and the power button at the same time hold the button for five seconds and when the pawn rebooted quickly switch from the volume up to the uh, volume down to the volume up like this okay let's wait maybe sometime for the first time you will not succeed so if you fail you need to try for several times and and you can see right here now we are in the stock recovery you can navigate using volume up volume down and confirm using the power button okay now let's select the wipe cast select yes and then select the wipe data and select vector reset okay when it's done you can select the reboot system now and let's wait until it goes to the home screen and now we are in the home welcome screen okay all you need to do is just hit next next until it goes to the home screen after that you need to connect to the internet using the sim card or wi-fi and now we are in the home screen now let's just for my file okay allow it internal storage so i have put it the uh, magis apk in here so we need to install it okay open give it permission and install it okay uh, where is it let's install it <clears> okay <throat> hey. after it finish we can open the apps and usually it will ask for permission okay require requires addition, additional setup 
it's okay and in five seconds it will automatically reboot the pawn okay make sure you have connect to the internet before for one minute if not the pawn will get boot loop okay now we have installed the magis alpha and i also have installed the root viewer root checker and empty manager okay now let's open it <coughs> you can see right here we have successfully installed a Magis. Okay. Okay. Now let's try to test it using this root checker. Okay. Granted. <clears throat> Your SMA seven two F is rooted. Okay. Nice. And uh, let's test using root beer. <clears throat> okay. Root beer also root read the root access and open the MT manager. Okay. <clears throat> granted and here we go okay done now from here you can activate the zygis <clears throat> and you can install elbows smiley picture and other stuff okay that's all guys i hope it helps you if you have any question feel free to ask on the comment section okay so see you in the next video